hi guys in this video we are going to change the port for this TCL we can see that the port is a bit shaky it is shaky so the port is bad so you need to take out the SIM tray Collect. So there's a fingerprint scanner I nearly forgot about it I'm telling you I nearly forgot right so what we're going to do we are going to be working in this area so we are not going to be studying the upper part of the phone we're going to remove all those screws quickly And this is the port we are going to examine the port and we are going to see if we have any but first let me just test the port one more time just to see if it's this ribbon wasn't done properly let's see are we getting the phone to charge move these out of the way uh no so guys i'm gonna unplug we're going to unplug this ribbon here and we also have antenna cable remove that and we're going to see if we can remove the board we should be able to remove the board now so So we just removed the board and I'm going to examine to see if I have this port. So guys, actually we don't have the same exact port. If you actually look, this one is slightly different. I don't have any like that. I don't know if I'll be able to pull any from any old devices. Uh, these ports are the same polarity as the one that is on the board so I am not sure if any one of these can work but let's try We just want to just observe this port because like this port is flat on the top if you look at these ports the three of them they are all different so we are going to see which one can work so guys this one is too big and this one is ideal so what i am going to do i am going to try this one to see if it will work so i want to ensure that it is aligned properly i'm thinking that this may not work but i am going to try So this time I did not go all the way. I am going to examine the board and then based on what I see then I go forward. 
I am looking and I think that we have a small chance. I already saw that the back pins are not touching. So we need to go down more. Right? I already saw that. We actually need to go down more. Right? So... I'm going to use a bit of flux on this side. Uh, also... Okay guys, um, I think that we were able to somewhat get this down a bit, but I am not sure if it will work. It may work, but the funny thing is guys, it may not fit down the back of the phone properly because this port seems to be a bit higher. Uh, we are going to still see if we can get this down that's the farthest we can get this down so guys the port is replaced as you can see I believe that this is a bit high because of the difference with the ports but however we are going to try it and we are going to see it will work it should work but unfortunately once it is able to stick down well after we put back on the back cover once everything goes down perfectly then you know that we are good i am just going to reflow the board quickly and then we are going to test So we are actually going in this way, right? Right, we're going in this way and we need to reconnect the antenna cable. So I am going to connect the antenna cable, hoping that we don't have to take this back off. So that's done. Then we need to connect this cable right here. And that's connected. Now we are going to see how this fit on. And this is the way. And I am going to say not bad. Not bad, but it is actually a bit bulky. It is actually a bit bulky, not bad, but it is bulky. Uh, it is bulky. I do need to order some of those ports. However, I am going to test to see if this port is charging. We need to put the charger in this way. And let's see. So the phone is on. And I know that the phone will charge, but because it is not the correct port, guys, for us to fit the back on might be some problem. Right? So, yeah, and I noticed a difference before I started. This port do have a lip, as you can see, outer lip. And that lip is curved, as you can see and the original lip doesn't have any lip or curve it is actually flat like flat so we have some problems here
for us to actually fit this in I don't know how we are going to do this but I'm going to try let's see oh this is going to be difficult it's going to be difficult but we are going to try right what I need to do is to plug in the charger if all goes well then we should be good Well, this seems to be the problem which we have but guys luckily I was able to get this in and it's charging so that's a relief that's a relief oftentimes you don't get away you don't you just don't get away using a different port in a phone but We tried and it worked so I'm going to put back in all the screws So we have two more screws remaining here and so guys you can see the outer lip I want to show you closely you can see the outer lip hanging there if you look however let's see if we can close this back and yeah i do believe at times when i do stuff like when i do port like this i try my best to modify the space because the individual can damage the port again because we don't have the, the wide enough space to plug in the charger but hey charger is tight and we are good so we are done I can feel this area feel a bit bulky than usual here yeah? but definitely guys we do have this port and this is what we have to do for us to actually get the correct thing will take some time and I don't think that the individual want to wait that long so yeah we're done if you enjoy this video guys do like share and subscribe and also you can let me know in the comment section and also you can let me know in the comment section bye bye